We formed Team Vigor to participate in this challenge, bringing in the Technical University of Darmstadt, uh, Virginia Tech, and Oregon State University to participate. And then we've also added the Interactive Digital Humans Group from Montpellier in France. One of the things that we've been able to do is, is bring everyone here to Blacksburg to work on the project. It's not the most typical thing you might expect uh, here in Southwest Virginia. We actually rented a house so that all of our team members could live in that house together and really live, breathe, and eat the DARPA Robotics Challenge. Well, the, the, the challenge is really that we humans have a very sophisticated sensory and actuation system that makes it very easy for us to pick things up and interact with the environment. And it's very hard for robots to do that because uh, yeah, they, they have very limited sensing generally. So, so when they pick stuff up, they exert forces on things and generally try to uh, tend to break things. The main things we added are these shells that show off our sponsors and the names of the team, name, team members. Fortunately, we have a team that's very, very experienced with real world robotics and real world robotics competitions. I think we'll win because we really have a diverse and uh, impressive set of talents on our team. We're really widespread internationally. Uh, we have some of the best researchers from Germany as well as France here working with us. And we've had everybody working together in a really close-knit environment. There's a great team atmosphere and everyone's got a singular goal to do as well as we can. And uh, I think that'll show in the competition.